guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Anita from Anita's Cake Bakery. Today I have two very special guests in the kitchen. They are my sons Nathaniel and Noah. Hi! We will be showing you how to make delicious Millie's cookies. To make the cookies you will need 125 grams of butter softened 100 grams light brown soft sugar 125 grams of caster sugar 1 egg lightly beaten 1 teaspoon of vanilla extract 225 sort of raisin flour a half teaspoon of salt and 200 grams of chocolate chips but we've also added some white chocolate to the yeah. chocolate chips yeah. okay let's get started so first we need to cream the butter and the sugar together so do you want to add the butter and the sugar yeah i'm gonna add the sugar all of it yeah so we've mixed the um, white sugar and the brown sugar together so we'll just pour that right in okay. we're going to mix this lightly so we're going to mix that by hand well actually you can use the you mixer. can actually use can this to mix. mix it so you can do it together just mixing the butter and the brown sugar together and the white sugar yeah wait I don't is that white sugar in there? Yeah, I mixed the white sugar and the brown sugar together already. I don't see that. Uh, a little bit more. So you have to be looking at it. Just turn it up a little. So, it looks, it just like, it just looks like the, the sugar in there, not butter. Because it's all combined, doesn't it? So that's slightly mixed. Let me just give it another quick one. And grind some more. Right, so stop that. Okay. Now we've done that. Next, we're thinking. What's gonna... next? Next, we're going to add the egg. So, so let me add the egg. Add the egg. Go and put that in. That's it. It's always too fast. Right, lightly mix that in. He wants to add the vanilla. Ven Add the vanilla into the mixture. Yes. So now we just put the vanilla in. Wait, it looks like it looks like icing. Though. Yeah, perfect. Right, that's good. There. Now we're going to put the flour. flour. I've already sifted the flour, so they're just going to pour it straight in. Oh, and the salt. Sorry. You can use the spoon to mix this in. Now I'm going to add the chocolate chips. Go on then. Now I should do... I should do the chocolate No, let me do some more. I can hold the bowl. Oh my goodness. Look at that. That so looks so delicious. Good. Yeah, it's delicious. So I'll give it a bit of a mix just to get round yeah. the sides. Yeah. And make sure that then we I'm get all mix. of the flour from the bottom of the bowl. Oh, that looks so nice. There's more chocolate chips than mm, the... Lots of chocolate chips. And we add some uh, was, white too. I was so expecting white chocolate chips. chips. Well, we've got some white in there. Let me just get a spoon just to scrape all the uh, things yeah, from scrape, the bottom. Scrape the mixture of the spoon mm -hmm. and on the inside. So we get uh, some more. Then you can continue mixing. Then I just make, 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 make. Right. Are we still so, going to add the uh, sprinkles? Do you want sprinkles in there? Yeah. Right. We'll add some to a few of them actually and see what they'd look like. Yeah, so like sprinkle some. We're going to add some. We're going to put some. We're going to half some. So, like, normal there and we're gonna add sprinkles on the other side okay yeah. i need to grab the sprinkles then oh so we've put everything in there so now we need to oh make them into balls right so we're going to make them into balls to put them on your grease proof the sound's gonna tray. Go. i don't what you two need to do now is we, need you just need to... we don't oh. need the spoon but this is what you're going to do oh, bits like this you be like there. this make sure there is a space between the balls brilliant and 
If there's no space in between the balls, what do you think will happen? They will step the, together the, and make a giant the... one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And, and if you got a small pan, get a big one. Yeah, we need a big tray. Tray. I think we'll probably only fit nine on this tray. Actually. And then we can Twelve. add some sprinkles. If there's no space, we can oh. add some sprinkles on the other on the others. Yeah. We'll, we'll have to do another tray. Wait, we're um, hardly putting any chocolate chips. No, uh, white this chocolate. all mix, mixed in. I put loads of white chocolate in there. I'll get another tray so you can do the ones with the sprinkles. With sprinkles. Okay, we'll add sprinkles to the next lot. So I'm going to grab another tray because we've still got some mixture left and they're going to add some sprinkles to that. So it needs to be placed in the oven for 7 to 10 minutes depending on how chewy or crunchy you want the cookies to be. So if you want them to be quite chewy, I'd say leave them in for 7 minutes. If you want them to be a bit more crunchy, leave them in for a few minutes extra but no more than 10 minutes and that will give you a crunchy cookie. So, uh, eight minutes or nine minutes or ten minutes? Just as long as it's no more than ten minutes. I want the sprinkles one to be crunchy. And you want yours to be what, Nathaniel? Chewy. Chewy. Alright, so we're going to put these in the oven for around seven minutes. One, let me, let me do. Let me do. And one Maybe more. We're going to put one more. Too much because I didn't really put that much. Wait, I think three. Three. One, two. I think that's enough sprinkles. How do you think these cookies are going to be with sprinkles inside? Maybe. Maybe. Well, the crunchy Maybe. ones will be soft. <sighs> well, they won't be soft if we keep them in long enough. Wait. Well. Why don't we leave them in the oven? Well, nothing will happen as long as it doesn't burn. We don't want them to burn, do we? Yeah. Okay, so this is your sprinkle chocolate chip cookies. Do you They're think it needs enough. more sprinkles? Is that okay? No, uh, that's not. There's one more teaspoon. Mm -hmm. well, uh, I'm gonna do this one. You dip it in, and then I, no, I well, I these two are obviously the experimenting, so we'll see how this works out. Wait, what if the sprinkles make it extra crunchy? Oh, okay. Let's see what happens. Okay, now. Right, give that a mix, and then uh, mix. Just mix it a little I bit. I really want to mix it with one. my hand. You can. Oh, okay. yeah. Just the sprinkles. Wait. Wait, no, 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 no. actually, yeah. All right, now you, so you're going to make them into a ball. That's okay now, Nathaniel. Right. My hands are so sticky, and... Okay, now, okay, now I'm just going to roll this into a ball. Okay, okay. Yeah, let's see how they turn them out. <laughs> my foot After, I'm going to wash my hands twice. <laughs> because your hands are so sticky? Yes. And my but this one's a little bit too small. Do them a bit bigger. No, do them a little this bit. This one's a bit bold. tiny, anyway, it doesn't matter. Yeah, some biscuits can be tiny, some can be big, some can be big. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Some on the floor there. Yeah. Okay, not me good. Good. This not one really good at good. cooking because I keep doing biscuits more. Every day we do biscuits, but. Well, I'm not. <laughs> Every day? No, we don't. I'm making them so small. Yeah, because I'm not only a professional at cooking. Okay, okay. Okay, we can have some small ones, it's fine. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. They can be babies. Babies. Yeah, babies. <laughs> can I have this one? <laughs> okay, come on. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, they're yeah. tiny. <laughs> <laughs> I think most of it's on the floor. Nope. Oh, okay. We've actually made quite a few cookies, but I think that's because, well, that is because they've made some that really gonna stick to tiny small. ones. While we're waiting for the ones in the oven to finish off, we've got another four minutes left on that. These boys are going to wash their hands. So we just took them out of the oven. This is the one that's sprinkled. This one is the one that is not sprinkled, just chocolate. The um, cookie that we left in the oven for 10 minutes. This is the cookie that we left in the oven for seven minutes. Two. So this is the softer one. We left this in for seven minutes. And this one should be the crunchier one because we left this in for 10 minutes. Mmm. Mm. Oh, That's nice and chewy, that one. Yeah. What's your one like, Nathaniel? It's a little bit hard. Crunchy. So what about the sprinkles? How did that work out then? Great. 
Perfect. You can't really see it that much, but it was a good idea putting the sprinkles in. Thank you for watching us make these cookies today. Don't forget to subscribe and share with your friends. Bye. See you next time. Bye. See you next time. Bye.